First time I saw her, it was in Cleveland at the Waldorf Towers. I got in the elevator and I was going up and the elevator stopped. Across the ocean. And she walked in with her parents and it, it was like a lightning bolt struck me. I remember my mom saying like, wow, those two look like strapping young men. Life he wanted, and there she loved him. I thought she was gorgeous from the first time I ever saw her. And he loved, he loved her, he loved her too. Connie, I love you so much. You are so important to me. She's grown into an incredible, compassionate, and accomplished young woman who has followed her dreams and her heart. And I'm so grateful to be here to share in this moment with you. Love will find this way. is easy. I want to cry if it makes it worthwhile. But we may never pass this way again. Peace and quiet, pain the pleasure, the only one she'd ever love. You know, I feel like we can handle anything that the world throws at us and anything that, that happens. I want her to be by my side. You know, I think we can, we can have a great life together because it's been great so far and the past six years have been the best years of my life. You know, our future is so bright and I just really look forward to, to sharing it with her. I, Bill, take you, Connie to be my wife. I'm looking forward to having a life full of laughter, having a wonderful husband, and yes, I would like to kind of end like how the notebook ended, you know, just have like that companionship and that passion for each other. All of our lives we are searching for someone who goes through our souls follow Searching for someone to move through our souls to follow forever. All of our lives, we are searching for someone to move through our souls to follow forever.